I'm Mrs. Ursic. I'm the reading specialist here, and you may notice that I'm in a new room this year, um, temporarily for COVID purposes. I am in room 108, which is the former math lab, and we're right here next to the elevator on the first floor. And when your children work with me, I will escort them from their classroom to our room, and we'll come on in and show you around a little bit. Currently, we are in assessment mode, so I'm working with children one-on-one -on -one to assess their skills at the beginning of the year. This is kind of a, this is what our assessment table looks like. We've got the plexiglass. We are um, sanitizing in between each child, chairs, desk, materials. Um, when I do start working with small groups in a, in a couple of weeks, there will be a max of six children in here at a time, and they will each be at their own table. So every child will be at a table like this, and um, it is all spaced out appropriately. Feeling so grateful to have the extra space this year to do this, to teach your children safely. I'll talk a little bit about myself and the program. And I am a proud St. Mary graduate. I am so thankful to be here in this role and working with your children. Um, I also went to Ursuline Academy and then to Miami for undergrad. I went to Xavier to get my master's in reading. And um, on a personal note, I'm married to Neil, who is currently my videographer. And we have two daughters, Audrey, who's three and a half, and Grace, who is one and a half. This is my 11th year of teaching, my fourth year here at St. Mary. And again, it's just my dream job. So I'm feeling very thankful to be here. I provide, as reading specialist, I provide extra reading support for students in grades K through three, primarily. So what those services look like, oh, actually really quick, um, new this year, as mentioned, we're in the new, a new room, um, following all of the COVID protocols with appropriate distance, sanitizing, no shared materials, etc. So reading services at St. Mary are funded by the federal and state governments, and you may have heard of the terms Title I and Auxiliary. Title I refers to federal funds, Auxiliary comes from the state. I am employed through Cincinnati Public Schools, but am very fortunate to be here um, at St. Mary. There is a qualification process for children to work with me. Every year, children need to re-qualify, even if I've worked with them before. And that process is um, a multi-criterion process. There are assessments involved and teacher referral, classroom performance. We look at all of that as we figure out who will be qualifying for services. For those who do qualify, uh, the parents will receive a permission slip and a letter explaining everything. And um, so you will, if your child does qualify to work with me, you will receive those uh, notifications within the next couple of weeks. Specifically for those parents of children who I will work with, there will be an October meeting with more information and that will likely be virtual, but I'll keep you posted. Um, the, in that meeting, I will go into specifics about what we do in each grade level and specific ways that you can help at home. If you need to get a hold of me at any time, I do have a teacher website available through the St. Mary website. You, whether your child works with me or not, you are welcome to access that. There are lots of resources on there related to reading. And of course you can email me at any time. Um, my email address is right there and accessible everywhere on the website, etc. I do also have an Instagram account, a uh, private Instagram account for fun to share uh, reading resources, tips, strategies with you. Uh, I am here on Mondays through Wednesdays this year and looking forward to a great year. Thanks for watching.